Welcome back to my channel where I'll be reviewing this level 10 season reward Musa card. I think we've got to have a closer look at this card, see what I think of it. So medium, medium work rates, 4 star, 3 star. At the moment, not necessarily anything spectacular. Positions, he doesn't have many positions, just a centre mid, right mid. Play styles wise, he's got a nice little selection of play styles. However, you could potentially add to this because I need to quickly show you something before we go into the stats of the card. So I'm in the evolution section and there's that future stars glow up. And if you haven't already done it, you can put this Musa into it. And by doing such a thing, you'll get some extra stats and a playstyle plus. Which, and I'm looking at this thinking might be a very nice viable thing because if we look at the actual stats of this card very nice looking potential cdm card but let's go back to the base card but if you weren't to do that evolution these stats on its own on the base version is still very good without needing to upgrade it he's got good pace Shooting's pretty okay if you're maybe going for a box-to-box -box player and playing him at centre mid. Passing's all right. You could potentially upgrade that with a chem style. Defending as well is pretty nice looking. And the physicality as well. Like This looks like a very nice all-rounded card. But for me, I'm going to play him at CDM because I play for triple two in-game. And I'm going to go with an anchor as the chem style to boost that pace, defending and physicality. Which will help him out in a CDM role, I'm hoping. Here's the team that he's in. We're going to play the cup games because I need to get those done. And hopefully, he'll be very good in that CDM role. Oh, Musa's received it. Go on, then. <laughs> that is unexpected. I was not going to think I was going to get a assist for him this early on. All right, well... That's good, but we want to see him do some some defensive work, though. All right, come on, Musa, Musa, come on, get in the box. Let's offer. Oh crap, that's a sweaty guy. I should have seen that coming in some ways and done a better job. I was trying to get Musa in the box. I was more focusing on him. Okay, he comes in to help win the ball back with Kevin De Bruyne, and he's making a run into the box. Win the header. Okay, he partially does. Go on, take a shot. Nice shot. Oh my god. No! How have I not scored there? Well, he's winning the second balls. He's not making any tackles at the moment, but he's also barging forwards quite a lot as well, which is good. Ah, there we go. Ah, I mean... He, he tried to win the ball back, shall we say. Uh, he ended up falling flat on his face in the process, which is worrying for uh, a player of that physicality. He's making the run up. Come on. All right. Maybe we need him in a more attacking style role right now because that's two assists. He's not really done anything defensively, but he's managed to get some assists. And he does seem to like running up the pitch. And I think a box-to-box a -box centre mid-style role would be better. But it's not really a formation that I tend to use as something with centre mids. See? So, Rijkaard wins it. Musa picks it up. And we get another attack going from that pass. Game number one and his stats. So he only lost the ball three times. He's won the ball twice in that game. He's got two assists. Only had the one shot. He's got good passing accuracy. Dribble success rate was pretty good as well. I, I just haven't seen anything defensively from him. But at the moment, my initial thoughts is a centre mid might be a fantastic position for him. But we'll go into another game and see what else he does. Ah, he's won it from the edge of the box. Let's take a long shot. Just wide. There you go. He's making the run forwards. 
Do you know what? Go on then. Make the run. Get the shot off. <sighs> Saved by the goalkeeper. Oh no, here we go. Don't you dare to... Good blocks. Come on, Alisson. Where is Musa in there? I don't know. Okay, winning the ball off of kickoff. Good. Ah, oh, lovely through ball. Go over the top. Go over the top. Um, that's not really a chip shot, Martinelli. But that was a lovely pass by Musa. Okay, don't let him. Come on, win the ball. Ah, he's let Griezmann pass. He's let Griezmann pass and now I'm 2-1 down. Three one. Three one. Oh dear. Oh dear. Nice pass again. Yeah, okay. So I do think maybe CDM's not his position. I think he de well, he definitely can win the ball back, but I don't think he seems to be a, a natural CDM kind of card. So, lost that second game. So, let's talk about the card itself. I definitely don't think CDM is a comfortable role for him. I don't know what it was, but in-game, defensively, he would just let attacking players slightly past him. He didn't necessarily put in the tackles, even if you're asking it for to him to do it. He didn't seem to have that physical presence at CDM that you kind of need to have. But... He is a good card, and I think as a box-to-box -box player and a playmaking centre mid, he did very good. Like, he got three assists, for God's sakes. Like, I wasn't expecting that from him as a CDM. His passing was fantastic, and that pace definitely would help in that sort of, like, centre mid style box-to-box -box role. One thing I would say about this card is you're going to probably have to substitute him off in the second half. 83 stamina is a very good amount of stamina. But I think at the way the game works, anything below 90 and without Relentless definitely are the type of players that you have to substitute in the second half. So bear that in mind when using the card. But I do think it's a fantastic card. And the fact that it's free from season rewards it is definitely one of maybe potentially top three free season reward cards that or objective cards that EA have released so far in FC24. But that's going to be it for this player review. Thank you for watching. But let me know in the comments section if you use this card what you think of it. But I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye-bye, guys.